Schmuck. Bathrooms are down the hall and to the left. Obviously, you jackass. Do you always barrel over misdirected patrons? Only when they come trip trapping with their fancy heels into my house. Okay, you big old troll. I'll just trip trap my way off this bridge. But be warned because my big bad brother is right behind me. Laura Ann Sharpman. seen my latest HBO special? No. Read my book, Lauren Wheels, Her Sharp Tongue? No. My act last weekend at the Ha Ha Larius? You don't recognize me. Oh, please, I see so many people every day. Uh, Comedy Cottage, July 1982. Yeah. No. Gerald? Gerald the Great Macintosh, is that you? In the flesh, Miss Prissy Pants. <laughs> oh, I, um, uh, you look good, Jer. Yeah, yeah, well, uh, we all can't snag a golden ticket, Laura Ann. Golden ticket? I earn my way. Oh, yeah, sure. Uh, whatever, I gotta get back to work. Mackie was no golden ticket. He was a one-way ticket to Las Vegas. Well, good for you. I needed a fresh start. Our van was dead, and there was nothing for me here. Ladies and gentlemen, let's give a round of applause for our next performer, Laura Ann. you were Carol Burnett or Joan Rivers. I got heckled long before I even got a word out, and no one took me seriously. Well, they do now. Damn straight they do. I earned it, you fool. I watched, I learned, I planned, until I could find the right time. And I was a cocktail waitress at the Herod for six years, long before I even got a shot at an open mic on the strip. Mackie left me at a gas station three hours outside of Sin City with six dollars and black eyes. to get to where I am today. And I deserve everything I have. I bet you do. But what happened to you, Jer? Life. 
But how? You're here. Yeah. Was it the drink? The drugs? Did you knock up some sweet gale from Winneka? What the hell difference does it make? Hmm? Why do you care, Miss HBO special and, and latest biography hotshot? Do you think every person has to have a reason, a vice, some trip up that kept them from the high ranks of success? Or are you fishing for an antidote to entertain your friends with? Well, I'm not even a footnote in one of your best-selling books. Hmm? Now you can take your little Sherpman ass out of here. I didn't mean to... You, you didn't mean what? Hmm? To judge me? To, to crimp your neck as you drive by my train wreck of a life? Well, your pity isn't needed or appreciated, Miss Sharpman. Don't let the door hit you on your way out. Duty calls. Oh, I'm, I, I'm sorry, Jerry. Oh, that's okay. Whatever. Congratulations and all that good shit. I wasn't trying to, to judge you or make you feel... Jared, now! Less... You made the big time. Laura Ann. I'm so glad your dreams came true. I'm so sorry. Your dreams did not. Let's welcome back to the stage, Laura and Sharkman.